So, these are the transposing instruments. So on this list are the transposing instruments and basically transposing instruments may be written in treble or bass clef but their pitch is not a concert pitch and they play a different pitch than is actually written. So first off we have the glockenspiel which is a German word. It's a percussion instrument and it is an instrument that is written in treble clef but its notes are two octaves higher than it is written. Xylophone. A xylophone has is written in treble clef but its notes are an octave higher than written sound an octave higher than written. The bass and bass guitar are written in bass clef Actually, bass guitar can be written in treble clef, but bass and bass guitar are written like a C is a C for them, but they are an octave lower than written. The trumpet, clar trumpets, and clarinets. Trumpet and clarinet are both transposing instruments. They are both usually pitched in B flat, which means their C, their written C, sounds as a concert B flat. Well, Clarinets and trumpets have other pitched instruments like A have other instrument well trumpets and clarinets can be another can be another transpositions like an like A E flat D for trumpets C for trumpets, which is a concert pitch, and F, which would be the same as a French horn. They are usually pitched in B flat for most concert bands when ensembles, which is a band, and some orchestras depending on the what the piece of music calls for. Horn and English horn. French horn and English horn have are both in treble written in treble clef. They are both transposing instruments and they are pitched in F. Not meaning they're always in the key of F. Notice how I didn't say they were, but they are pitched a fifth down from the pitch that they are sounding. So they're, if they are written at a middle C, then they are at the F below middle C. While horn, while a French horn can be an E flat or B flat or C, high C horn or low C horn or D or basically 
composers write for horn in any key that they want, in any pitch that they want to. But most of the time in bands and orchestras, horns are written in F. That, but they can be written in another transpose, transposition. Bass clarinet. Bass clarinet is usually in the key in, written in B flat transposition. But there can be E flat bass clarinets. The only difference that I can think of is the range difference on a on a B flat bass clarinet. Its range is the same written the same as a B flat clarinet but it is but it is it sounds it sounds an octave lower um the there is also a contra bass clarinet pitched in e flat and the that would be two octaves lower than well an octave lower than the bass clarinet an octave and a fifth i should say Contrabassoon. The contrabassoon is a bassoon pitched an octave below the regular bassoon. So it sounds an octave lower than it is written. It has basically the same range as a regular bassoon, just an octave lower. What I didn't write down here is saxophones. Saxophones are usually a band instrument, but can be used in orchestras as well, occasionally. A few examples are Mazorgsky's um, Pictures and an Exhibition and there's one more Rhapsody in Blue for a jazz orchestra. Anyway, back to saxophones. Saxophones are usually pitched in E flat or B flat. You'll be hard pressed to find a saxophone that isn't in E flat or B flat. And saxophones are pitched in a way that they represent the different voice types. Soprano saxophones the highest usually used. These are the ones usually used. Soprano, alto, tenor, berry, and bass baritone and bass. There's also a contrabass saxophone 
and sopranino saxophone, but sopranos in B flat, same as a trumpet, B flat trumpet, altos in E flat, which goes pretty well with them sharing the French horn parts. Tenors in B flat, usually written written in with uh, trombones and euphoniums. And baritone is in E flat, usually usually written in with the bass clarinet, bassoon, and tuba parts. And that's all for this video, and thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!